A physical product, also known as a tangible product, is something that you need to ship to a customer. You might consider this option if you sell audio files for streaming or downloading and you want to sell a CD of the music. Or perhaps you sell t-shirts or paper books or chairs. To add a physical product, click the products link in the main menu and then click add product. Of the four options, select product. We'll look at the other three, service, subscription and bundle, in another video. Along the top, you'll see different options for your product. Select physical. There are three pieces of information required to create a physical product. The name of the product, the price of the product, and a sales limit. We'll talk about that in just a moment. We'll be super original and call the product physical product. I'll also charge $9.99. With the sales limit, I can configure how many items I want to sell. For example, I might only have 15 copies of my exclusive CD, in which case I would enter 15 into the sales limit box. In my case though, I believe I can keep up with sales and so I'll leave it blank and there'll be no limit applied. When you're ready, click create product. You'll be taken straight to the button code page and below this video will be a link that outlines what the different codes are and how to use them to sell your product. There's two more aspects to physical products that we need to examine. Firstly, the sequence of events and notifications you and the buyer receives. Secondly, shipping rates. We'll look at shipping rates in a separate video, but it is an important part of selling physical products. The first big difference is the requirement for an address. You need this so you can ship the product to the buyer. When the customer completes their address, they are taken to the standard checkout page. On completion of the purchase, you, the seller, receive two emails, a payment notification email and a goods ordered email. The goods ordered email informs you of the sale and the address to post the physical product. At the same time, the buyer receives the receipt for the purchase and a notification that the goods will be posted shortly and they will be notified when it has been dispatched. When you, the seller, are ready, click the link in the goods ordered email. That will take you to your send out control panel where you will see the pop-up where you can dispatch the order. You can enter tracking information if your delivery company has any, and when ready, click Mark as Dispatched. Finally, on marking the physical product as dispatched, the customer receives an email informing them the goods have been dispatched. Any tracking information you included will also be in that email. That's it. The buyer is simply waiting for delivery.